Hello everyone, Praise Good here, and welcome back to more of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Last time, we learned about, well, our last two playable characters. Which, one is one and the same, and the other is, well, two in the one. You know, that made no sense, but we're gonna roll with it. Anyway, so much like with side quests from here on to the end, I'm gonna just sweep left to right, no preference or anything. But, something I want to get into before we get started here. Cause, and I'm going to mention this again when we're on the final episode itself. Have you folks been enjoying the series? I, this is a legit question. This isn't me trying to drive engagement. Do you Did you enjoy the series? Because as I said early on at some point in the series, this is me putting my foot in the water for potentially making more series about Dynasty Warriors style games. Granted, I probably picked a very high note to start with, but... Do you want to see more projects in the future of Dynasty Warriors, Muso Fighters, things of, you know, that same, you know, they're the same thing effectively. Do you want to see more projects based on this? I may do it if I enjoy a game enough, but if you folks really like this kind of style, I'll do more projects. I, I have plenty of Dynasty Warriors style games. It's just that some of them may be more blind playthroughs than, you know, educated play playthroughs. Anyway, that aside, let's go ahead and start diving into quests. Let's just, let's go dive into quests and take Impa into this one because we haven't seen Impa for a hot minute. Let's go into the side quests that basically stand between us and the end of the game. Now I will say, again, it's all bittersweet right now. Like I very much, I very much love this game. I very much think it's a very good Musa fighter. It's a very good, like, it's a it's a good stepping stone game for those that are interested in Musa fighters, but love Legend of Zelda and weren't too, so sure about it. It's also the opposite, oddly enough. Like, this is overall, this overall is just a good game. But also remember that I'm somebody who is a, is basically shackled to, uh, it's basically shackled to, uh, oh boy. Give me that, give me that, give me that. Thank you. But yeah, just keep in mind, I'm someone who's like basically shackled to beat em ups and hack and slashes, and that's, and I love them to death. So take that as their grain of salt with this. But in the end, in the end with all this, in the end with all of this, you know, I will still say, you know, I will stand on that platform and say that this is, you know. Oh, I didn't use a suit. I didn't use a special. I used a. I. Wow. That's how. That's how good my. Uh, that's how good my. Uh, recognition. Hold on. Short term memory is. There we go. That's the right word. But yeah, just. Uh, like, I could play. As bad as it is, I could probably play Musa Fighters for a long, long time for to come. If I had the time to play him for more to come. Anyway. So there is this Coliseum, but I will tell you that there is even an even bigger batter Coliseum at some point in the future. So don't think that just because we're here now with this Coliseum and it's like this just because we're here now with this Coliseum as it is, that this is like the last we'll see of Coliseums. No, there's still more. Like, there's there's some stuff that can still squeeze out of these last little bits of DLC that they gave us for this game. So we aren't done. We aren't done with like staple stuff for a while. It's just that you know, nothing is. It's just that we're no longer tied to a story, so to say. Now we're just tied to how fast can you hit the how fast can you hit the Y button, really? And in my case. Uh, I can kind of I can hit it kind of fast actually. No. The answer is no. I will say that this battle is probably going to take almost no time just because of. It will take almost no time to finish this. Just because it is Impa. Impa do be doing Impa things. I'm gonna get one more special gauge now. We'll, now we'll KO it. Impa do be doing special things. And the fact that she is, what, she is actually the second character you get in the game. And I would argue, and I, ha I think I've said this part, but I would argue that she is probably the strongest character in this game. Mouse Lionels. Ah, good. I remember this fight on Apocalyptic. I think this, I think this one mission on Apocalyptic took me a good two hours. 
I should hopefully be saving you from that same headache by being the person doing the walkthrough ring so you don't have to like sit through all that struggle. Get out of there. Get out of there twice. Okay, apparently I just get I get apparently I just get flurry rushes. That's all I do now, is just get flurry rushes. All I do is win, 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 win. <laughs> Actually, I just thought about this. There we go. Give me my juice. Okay, and now we get rid of him. But yeah, on Apocalypse difficulty, um, I don't remember if I used Impa for this as well or not, but on Apocalyptic difficulty, these guys definitely one-shot you. Like, they definitely one-shot you. No question about it. Well, two-shot you, but yeah. So imagine just coming into this fight. Imagine coming into this mission. Imagine coming into this mission and just be like, oh yeah, they're just a bunch of strong enemies. Level 80, that's fine. I guess I'll just deal with it. And then, and then being reminded of your mortality rate. Constantly. Like, basically, you screw up dodging three... You screw up dodging twice, and that's it. You don't get to play the game anymore. Alright, here. You can have Bump. Oh, that wasn't... Oh, I thought you were the dead. Back up. And let him do a slam, and this is the attack I usually counter. Oh, how did I... You know what? We don't question these things. We don't question these things, we just throw bombs around. Para bailar la bomb. Oops. He goes squish now. But yeah, so, because we're playing on hard, you know, this is actually laughably easy in comparison. Whoop. That ain't happening, champ. But yeah, because we're playing on hard in comparison to Apocalyptic, this mission's gonna go a lot simpler. And a lot quicker. Also, what, hang on. Oh! Hi, Calamity Ganon, once again. Gee, we should stop running into each other like this. Hold this L. You know, 11 minutes. 11 minutes to defeat Calamity Ganon. I mean, granted, Clammy again and soup, like super souped up from the last time we had this encounter, but it's still Calamity Ganon. And oh, because he's gonna do something stupid, right? Uh, that that's not the one. That's not the one. You know what? This works. Me trying to hit those things fast is going to be a problem. I'll tell you that much. No, I don't know what you're doing, but it's over now. Sorry, Calamity Ganon. I, I realize you're big and foreboding and all that good good junk. But I'm Impa. I love you. Perish. And we're running away from that and going back in. Man, you actually got some heft to you today. Like, I thought the last time I fought you was going to be... I thought the last time I fought you was going to be a problem. Nah, you got some heft to you today. Boy came... Boy came with his cinder block... With his cinder block armor and made sure he ate everybody's Wheaties. Yours, mine, his neighbors, the entire counties. Nobody has Wheaties today. Hi, how's it going? I don't know what you're trying to do, but stop. Man, this is really going to take a while. Like, normally, every other enemy I fought in this in this scenario would be dead by now, but not Calamity Ganon. He he said, he woke, he heard the, he, he heard the, uh, he heard the, the announcers say round 12, he said, I didn't hear no bell. Okay, are you sauced? Answer, he is. He is indeed sauced. Uh, Nope, that didn't work. One day I'll one day I'll use that properly. I finally took damage. I am a disgrace. I finally took a hit. Man. You really are holding on to that to that health bar that health bar, aren't you? I didn't think this would take this long. Like I understand that I am that you are supposed to be the last big bad in the game and all that jazz, but come on now, son. No. 
Man, if only I had HP recover up on Impa. Could you imagine the amount of health I would be stealing right now? Unfortunately, it only Link gets to do HP recovery. Only Link gets HP recovery up. Now we do it. I'm actually surprised that worked. Sorry, I I, I just adjusted my headphones because I just had the thought of wait, how long have I, these sounds sound a little too sound a little too impactful to be uh, sound a little too impactful to like not be coming out of my headphones not right now. Hold on, I had a moment of panic. Of, wait, am I have I really been bleeding over the sound from the game into my microphone like like a day one content creator like I used to be? I mean, everybody's got to learn some way, right? Uh, Bombadoo. Go get him. Okay, you did it. You got him. Hmm, that's a lot of special gauge. Would be a shame if I used it. Would be a shame if I used my special gauge. And then hot dogged a little bit. And did it again. In a second here. Would be a shame if I just hot dogged and, you know, used another special gauge. Wouldn't it? And then proceed to just death by a thousand cuts you for the rest of this. Do I need to even bother moving at this point? Oh. No, I don't. Uh. That's awkward. Hmm. Not exactly game breaking, but that do be a little bit of a, of a graphical glitch of sorts. Oops. Ah, I love this. I love this close up of the back of an Impa clone. It is my favorite, is my favorite serotonin depository. Anyway, me using, you, me using big words aside and failing at them probably. I think we have at least one more mission we can get done here. But I also want to say there is another level of Colosseum here beyond Master. I think there's like Master Plus or something dumb like that. Or even something beyond that. Yes, yes, yes. The vicious presence, the presence I can, the vicious presence I can flee. Nothing. Okay. Well, at this point, utmost strength. Hmm. You know, I think this might be the one I'm thinking of because that's mutated again in there in that in that shot. You know, we did get I did get linked to level 100. So let's see what Link at level 100 can do. Granted, I think this is meant to be like, I could be wrong, but I think this mission is supposed to be the final, final, final mission you tackle. I could be wrong. There could be one more that could pop up after every other side quest gets completed. But I will never know that because do you see those numbers in the lower left corner? Do you see how many supply based quests, side quests, and main story quests we have done in this, in this playthrough? Do you see all those numbers? Remember 180 things that aren't Pokemon. Anyway, I've come to fight you, Fire Black Ganon. Have you come to take away my sword beams? Yes, you have, actually. Wait, why did that hurt so bad? Why did that one attack hurt so bad? Why did that one attack hurt so bad? Hang on, I need some answers. Yeah, that one attack hurt like a son of a gun. Why? Well, I'm doing damage. I don't know if it's going to be enough to recover me quickly enough. Thank goodness I have all my stuff back so I can do what I want willy-nilly. Nah. See, this is the one I prefer to do. Where I just slap you in a corner and see what happens. I proceed to push you into a corner and slap you around a bit and see what happens. And it's funny like that, see? Yeah, go ahead and show me the power of your sword. I'll show you the power of mine first, because mine's a little bit stronger, I think you'll find. I don't know, the Master Sword against something, against fighting the thing that it's primarily meant to fight, 
I think the Master Sword wins out at the end of the day. I don't know. I could just be being weird about it. Ow. That was photo finish timing. I don't want I don't want to jump. Okay, why? Huh. Hey, you know what's funny? Ice. Okay, now that we've now that we've pushed Fire Black Ganon back to his corner and hopefully Wind Black Ganon will leave me alone longer to finish the fight. Wind Black Ganon, come on. You're being a jerk. Okay. Now that that's done, I didn't, I don't, I didn't remember this part of the fight where like the other blights is just like, nah, I'm coming to help fam. Anyway, hey, you wanted to fight, right? You wanted to fight? You wanted to fight me, didn't you? What's the problem? Why are you running? Why are you running? Stop running for me. But yeah, this fight is. I think this Coliseum, I remember being an absolute pain. Not because of, like they add additional uh, combatants like halfway through, like haha, additional combatants, but it's just you fight like the two, like these two blights together for some reason are a wombo combo of hatred that you never want to fight. But for some reason, like them together like this. That, yeah, for some reason, these two together like this, they are like the perfect combo of like, if you focus on one and uh, if you focus on one and don't turn your ten or, and don't, uh, if you focus on one of them and, and don't try to get them both together, they are tooled just right to be a nuisance to any plans you have. And uh, that's a wind tornado in my face. Okay, that's cute and all, but I'm going to need you to stop that chief and give me back some of my health that I've lost. Man, still alive after all this. I don't believe it. By the way, this is only hard mode. Imagine how much longer this would be on Apocalyptic. By the by, the way, add into the fact that this is a, with a level 100 character. Which I also had a level 100 character at the time I did this in my personal play file on Apocalyptic. But potato, tomato, cucumber, lettuce, lechuga, let's go. But yeah. Imagine how much longer that would have taken. Oh, by the way, you still aren't done, because look who's waiting for you at the end. I don't think this works. Yeah, this doesn't work. Freezing the, freezing Mute again doesn't work, as you can obviously, well, obviously, plainly tell at this point. So you just kind of got to go in with your wits at this point. Which, as you can tell, I don't have, I don't have those. Thankfully, what I do have is the ability to break break him because, haha, malice. Master Sword go brrrr. No. I said no to you, good I said no to you, sir. Good day, sir. Hey, Terrico. You fought this once before? Can I, can I get some good fighting tips? Whip, whip, whip. What do you mean, surrender? That's not in the script. Actually, what is in the script is actually bodying this thing. Uh, wrong combo. He is so big, I can't see my own combos. Anyway, thank goodness for this aspect of Link's kit, where he can just stun things as he wishes. No, I don't. I don't know what you were about to do, but don't do it. I said don't do it. When I say don't do it, I mean don't do it. Now let me see that big beautiful eye. That's very easy to hit. Okay, well, with that all done, well, we're not done yet, of course. We still have one more loop, but man, that uh. This is uh, actually kind of pathetic, I'm not going to lie. Anyway, finish the fight? Yes, finish the fight. Ugh. Blessed be.
get to show them how strong you are. Pretty good reward for it too. Thousand. Well, we haven't even gotten like the actual mission clear reward, have we? Okay, that was the mission clear, clear reward apparently, which is a bunch of Diamundos, or rather Sapphires. You know, we really just, we actually just spent a day at the Coliseum. That's really all we did today, is just spent an entire day at the Coliseum. And what is our reward for doing such? A kick in the pants and a, and a thank you card? You wish it was a thank you card. Ooh, I think that one's going to be the last one we do actually, hold on. Yes, that is the last one we're gonna do for this for this playthrough. That's the last mission. So, well for now, everyone, I do want to thank you all so much for watching this episode of Higher Warriors Age of Calamity. Come back next time when we'll pr uh, clear out probably these two quests right here, where my, right around where my cursor is. And then we'll probably get some su supply-based quests for Suga. We'll clear out these two quests over here, the uh, video after that. It's gonna be a whole thing. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care.